This video guides the installation of TSDZ8 motor, crank and speed sensor. Step 1. Accessories and Tool Step 2. Assemble the sprocket and chain set cover. Assemble the chain ring with M for Allen key and M5 screw. Assemble the chain ring cover set with a cross screwdriver and M for self-tapping screw. Step 3. Motor Installation Put the motor into the bottom bracket. Rotate the motor to check if motor touch the chain stay. Put the bottom bracket washer on the motor to avoid the chain stay. Before assembling the stiffening plate, we should pre-attach the stiffening plate screws and washers. If bottom bracket washers were used previously, then prefer longer stiffening plate screws in this step. Please notice the direction and position of stiffening plate, then we can assemble the stiffening plate on the motor. But don't lock to the end. You can add the correct amount of washers for the screws, but don't lock to the end. Assemble the bottom bracket lock nut. Turn the motor toward down to tighten the bottom bracket lock nut. Tighten stiffening plate screws. Assemble the bottom bracket lock nut cover. Tighten the bottom bracket lock nut by using bottom bracket nut wrench. Step 4. Crank and speed sensor installation. Assemble the left crank by using an 8 Allen key. Assemble the right crank by using an 8 Allen key. Use cable tie to lock the speed detect sensor on the chainstay.
screw the magnet on the spoke. Adjust the flat side of magnet to face with the arrow on the sensor.